Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying Holdsworth Homemade English Chocolates. These are great British chocolates. These are out right now at Home Goods for the spring slash Easter season. Um, so even though it's a box of just assorted chocolates, they don't have these all the time at Home Goods. Uh, we have had this brand before though. Last Easter, if you look up Holdsworth on, on the channel, you'll see that we tried some uh, great big Easter eggs from them with some beautiful artwork on them. They have those same Easter eggs this year as well at Home Goods. I haven't seen any different ones yet though. Um, so we haven't tried these, so that's why I've decided to get them. They were $12.99 but you get 16 it looks like 16 of uh, different flavors so 16 pieces chocolates. Six, yeah. 16 chocolates 16 yeah. yes eight flavors right yes i'm sorry yes <laughs> so it has a piece of paper so you get this is can you hold that up no no so you get you get okay. an idea. You get two. There you go. That's a good idea. Yeah, let me see if these are identical. Yes. I would just end up drawing yes. them all the time. These are identical. So you get two trays just like this one. So, um. You take that one out to see what's in the, what, what the flavor is there. What do you mean? You have to take that tray out of the bottom. Why? Because you flip it over, it'll fall out. Well, I was going to put the lid on there, but yeah, I guess that would be easier, <laughs> wouldn't it? <laughs> well, I, well, I could, but. Okay, so it's, let's see, uh, the picture, okay, the white one is a white rum truffle, which sounds right up my alley. Uh, Holdsworth Chocolate, the Chocolate Factory, these are made in Bakewell in Derbyshire. We won't um, have a picture of like the inside, but we'll, we'll have I'll kind of try to the hold outside. them up. I'll take one of uh, the outside. So it's www.holdsworthchocolates.co.uk. You can like taste the, the rum. I like the texture, it's really soft. Mm hmm. It's almost with it. I get them. Oh, it was after I had to push the other one underneath. You can absolutely taste that rum. Oh, yeah. The white, the mm -hmm. white chocolate is like. Almost just like the holder for the rum. You yeah. mainly taste the rum. It's very, very soft. Mm, it's very, very soft. Very creamy. This one is orange, uh, milk orange truffle. Mm. They're the orange. I actually like that one. Mm -hmm. Quite a bit. I like orange and milk chocolate anyway. Mm -hmm. Tastes much better than milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, it's just an overall sweeter experience. That is delicious. Yeah, it's very good. And it's very creamy. Um, the pink one the pink is, one. Um, it's called Sensational Pink Marc de Champagne <coughs> Truffle. Marc de Champagne Truffle. Sorry. I want to make sure they get hear. You know, this is a little denser. It's pink in the middle. Pink. I don't think I like that one. No, it's okay. It's not great. It's okay. I'm gonna do this one. Um. That had a very, very light flavor. Um, we've had, uh, there's a, a stronger brand from, um, there's another brand from the United Kingdom that makes a much stronger Marc de Champagne truffle. I like it better. That one is just really, really light. And this one is dark chocolate. This is the dark strawberry cream. <laughs> The difference in texture. Mm -hmm. Don't get a lot of strawberry from that though. Mostly just dark chocolate. 
It's a good chocolate though. What do you think it's good? I think it's very good. And I get a lot of strawberry. Did you? I didn't, mm. I didn't get hardly anything. A lot. That was all chocolate. The, um... Um... <laughs> they're a lot easier than I thought. <laughs> yeah. I went through the plate. Um, it, to me, that was a very strong strawberry. But I love the texture of it. I mean, there was a was lot of, um chocolate to bite into it was mm -hmm. a very very thick layer of that dark chocolate yeah but it truly i truly didn't get that was at all. nice if uh, you give me that and said what flavor is that was the dark chocolate this one is called dark grand mariner truffle mm. what's that whipped cream like texture inside the corner mm -hmm. i don't know what that is but this chocolate, so I can tell, but it's really good. It's nice. Um, it has a citrusy flavor to um, it. I it thought it has a little bit. Of yeah, in it really does. It, it's a. It, it almost reminds me a lot of that orange that we had earlier. Um, I can agree. Yeah. Um, this one is called dark cream de cacao truffle. Mm-hmm. Hmm. This dark chocolate. You don't get the um the cacao until really till after you swallow it and then you're left with that in your mouth. It's a little a little bit of bitterness, but it's Definitely. delicious. It's good. The good and textures. It's a good it's a nice finish. Because mm -hmm. you taste the chocolate, but then that is a really nice finish to have that little bit of bitterness, believe it or not. I agree. This one is the milk hazelnut praline. Mm -hmm. A little hazelnut. It's not the strongest hazelnut I've had, but it's, it's good. I've had some even really recently that was stronger, but. Mm -hmm. Huh, that's funny. Huh. You don't have one that's red? Mm hmm. Uh, well, this one is supposed to be a milk. <coughs> a milk Martin de Champagne. Yeah. Um. But, uh, the, the, you could taste it. It was uh, it was light. I thought. Yeah, come on. No, that's the same flavor. Mm -hmm. I think it's stronger than that. It is the alcoholic kind of flavor. Is stronger. Wow. Mm. That's a very. I mean, that's actually like alcohol in it. Yes. My like that, is wrapped in red. Like that burns your throat. Yes. Yeah, it's I bet, wrapped in red. I bet you it's wrapped mm -hmm. in red because it actually has alcohol in it. It seems like it. It's um, good. It's almost like a, a brandy ball or bourbon yes, ball or something. Yes. You could really taste the alcohol in that. That's or is in the, the pink one, you could not taste it at all. Uh, what I could taste, I didn't like. It was very light. I like that one and that white one. Uh, the Those white one is the, the white rum truffle. I thought yeah. that was good too. This is called the Union Jack Gift Box. So I'm assuming if you went to holdsworthchocolates.co.uk, you could look up the Union Jack gift box. It is 200 grams. Um, it did not have uh, calories on here, but um, it is made in Great Britain. You know, without having calories, then you just get to enjoy it, right? Yeah, no um, calories, but in say this. I think for for $13 though, um, I think it's, it's, a, I think it's a nice gift. Yeah. Yes, it's a nice gift. It's a gift. little higher quality chocolate than like Russell Stover's or, yes. or Whitman's or whatever. Yes, exactly. Um, so you're not getting as many for the same price that you would pay for those, but but they're I think they're a little higher quality. Right. So just know when you see this, if you see it, um, you know, Home Goods, Marshalls, uh, what is the other one? TJ Maxx. Yeah. I think those are all the same company. Yeah. If you see this brand. Safe to buy. Uh, yes, it's safe to buy. It's, it's a really good company. And if you get this yeah. box, eat all of them and save the white one and then 
the red, the red one, one last. They're, yes, because that red one is very Well, strong. that's the best one in the box. You yeah. save the best one for last, eat that one last. It really is good. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.